So you might be in a situation where for some reason iOS 16.7.11 is just not installing on your particular iPhone. Now this can happen for a couple of different reasons. There's never just one reason why something like this could end up happening. But the first thing I'd recommend kind of thinking about, the first thing I recommend doing is making sure you have enough storage saved on your iPhone. So make your way over into your iPhone settings, just like this. Tap into your general settings, go into your iPhone storage, and all you're going to want to do is make sure you have enough storage on your device. A lot of the times if you're running into these types of issues and these types of problems, it's usually because you just had some random issue like that. So make sure you have enough storage on your device. If you can guarantee that that's not the problem, the next thing I'm going to probably recommend to do is to go ahead, find your Wi-Fi and your cell connection, and just make sure your Wi-Fi and your cellular connection is not giving you any problems there either. Because sometimes that might end up being the issue too, and all you're going to have to do there is go ahead and basically just connect to a better connection, and that might end up fixing it for you as well. If that's still not working, you can also try restarting your phone. So go ahead, hold down the buttons you normally would to restart your phone, try restarting it, you know, powering it back on, and that might end up fixing the problem too. That's exactly what I recommend doing in this particular situation as well. So if you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.